This recording is the first 50 or so lines of the Aeneid Book 1. I'm not reading for emotional expression. I'm simply going to read it very slowly so that you can see how the um, scansion works. Essentially, the way the ictus works in Latin poetry, if you can imagine a duck swimming on the surface of the water, and underneath the water its feet are paddling in a regular fashion, the ictus is the beating of the feet of the duck. But on the surface, you just see the duck moving smoothly along. So you don't pronounce the ictus. A Roman poet would have either beat the ictus with their foot gently or moved their hand in some way. So the, the ictus was not something that expressed itself in speech. Uh, teachers often do this when they're teaching scansion in Latin class. However, it's a very bad habit because no Roman would ever have mangled their Latin in such a way, um, their spoken Latin. So here we go. Arma virumque cano Troiae qui primus aboris Italiam fato profagus la vinia venit litra multile terris jactatus et alto vi superum saivae memorem unonis sobiram multa quoquet bello passus dum condre turben Inferetque Deus Latio, genus unde Latinum, albanique patres, at qualtai moinia Romae. Musa, mihi, causas memora quo numene laeso. Quidve dolens, Regina Deum tot volvere casus, insignem pietate virum tot adire labores impulerit tantain animis caelestibus irae. Urps antiqua fuit, teri tenuere coloni, Carthag Italiam contra Tiberinac que longe ostia dives opum, tu diis quasperri ma belli. Quam iuno fertur terris, magis omnibus unam. Post habita coluisse sammo, hic cilius arma, hic currus fuit. Hoc regnum de agentibus esse, Si qua fata sinant iam tum tenditque foetque. Progeniem, sed enim Troiana sanguine duci. Audierat Tyrias olim, quae verteret arces. Hinc populum late regem beloque superbum, when Turexcidio Libiae sic vauere parcas. Id metuens, vetarisque memor Saturnia belli, prima, quod ad Troiam procaris gesterat argis, nec detiam causirarum saevique dolores. Excederant animo, Manet altamente repostum, iudicium paridis, spretai quin iuria formai, et genus in vis et rapti ganimedis honores, his ac censa super iactatos aequare toto. Troas reliquias, dannatque imitis Achilli, Arcebat longe latio multosque per annos, errabant acti fatis mariomnia circum. Tantae molis erat 
Romanam contragentem. Vix e conspectu siculae tiluris in altum. Vela dabant laetet spuma salis aere ruebant. Cum iuna eternum servans sub pectre vulnus haec secum. Men in capto de sistre victam, nec positalia teu crorum avertere rege. Quip vetor fatis, palas nec surre classem, argivat quipsos potuit submergere ponto, unius ob nox et furias saiacis oilei, ipsa Iovis, rapidum, iaculate nubibus ignem, disiecitque rates, evertit quae quaroentis. Il expirantem transfixo pectore flammas, turbine corripuit scopuloque infixit acuto, Ast ego, quae diu in cedo regina, io visquet soror et coniux, una cum gente tot annos bella gerret, quisquam numen iunonis adoret, praeteriat supplexaris imponat honore. Talia, Flamato secum de accorde volutans, Nimborim patriam, loca foita forentibus austris, Aeoliam venit, hic vasto rex aeolus, Antro luctantes ventos, Tempestatesque sonoras. Imperio premit, ac vinclis et carcere frainat. Il indignantes magno cum mumre montis circum claustra fremunt, celsa sedet eolus arce, sceptra tenens. Molit quanimos et temperat iras. Ni, Faciat mariac terras caelumque profundum, quippe ferrant rapidi secum verantque per auras. Sed, pater omnipotens, speiluncis abditit atris, hoc metoens, molemquet montes in super altos imposuit regemque dedit, qui faedere certo, et premret laxa sciret dare justus habenas.